And welcome back guys. We're going to be playing some more Sons of the Forest. We're going to go ahead and work our way to base uh, 2, which is going to be up by the helicopter crash site over by the water. And then from there we're going to work our way to the other side of the map and hopefully do endgame. Make sure you hit that like button, make sure you subscribe button. I might be doing a lot of muting. I just got done eating, so I, don't know, I doubt you want to hear me burp or you know, things like that. And of course it's snowing, and this is the worst time for this to happen. Alrighty. Just kind of giving you a heads up. If you hear me mute, that's probably why. It's not exactly professional as a streamer or content creator if you get to hear them burp or something. Some people like that. I don't like that. Going through a nuclear wonderland. Holy shit, it's cold. I'm just gonna boogie right through here. So there's one facility that we need to go to, and then there's the end game facility. I'm gonna specifically make a save outside at the pond. Probably they have a spot to save over there. That's why I can reload a previous save. I think we lose Calvin, but I'm not 100% sure. So, it's only one way to find out. Oh, no. Oh, I see you. No oh, here, yeah, no. Yeah. You want some? I don't think you want some. You go all quiet and shit as soon as I bring up the boomstick. Boom chaka laka. Boom chaka laka laka. <laughs> Look at me like goddamn. We got the boomstick out. <laughs> Shut up! Everything looks so different when it's snowing. I heard something. Hey, we made it. We didn't freeze to death. Day 70. Yikes. It's cold. <laughs> That's not creeping at all.
still need more. Alrighty. Oh! Mr. Cupcake is back. Hi! Could you stop doing that? And... Goodbye! Looks like it was just the one. Alright, so we need to travel up that way and around. Literally on the other side of that mountain. This is not going to be fun. On the journey we will go, on the journey we will go. <laughs> Supposedly there's like a bunker's entrance on the outside here somewhere, but it's way over there, so. Yeah, I'll probably be doing like a new save point. I don't know, like I said, there's there's a lot of unknowns. I was told that you lose Kelvin. But Kelvin is extremely helpful in gathering logs right now. So... I don't know. If I lose Kelvin, then I can go back to a previous save and... Call it close enough. <laughs> Although I really want my Cantana, so... I don't know. I haven't actually been to the bunker, I just hear that's what's in there. We are now officially halfway on the other side of the mountain here. We have to go all the way over to that green dot way over there, which is another location to enter. So I'm going to go to the revolver spot. Now you see why it's gathering stuff. It's a long trip in the woods. I wish yeah, I had him have a radio because, you know, this is going to be a long walk. Yeah, I could climb all the way up the mountain and just boogie board across the map, but I'm just like, eh. That's a cliff, so I'm probably better off on the pathway right now. Other than that, it's quite peaceful. Yes, I could go get a hang glider, but I have no idea where to find one of those. <laughs> do, 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 do. So we're going to be going to the revolver bunker, I believe, next. Oh, resupply, warm up, that type of thing. And then we'll go to the other green dot, and then we'll travel to the bunker. And then when I lose all my armor for all my creepy armor, I'll upgrade to gold armor. Or not gold armor, that tech armor shit. Do 
The only problem about building on that mountain, there's like no trees at the very top of it. And to bring trees up, it's just terrible. I was messing around with it, and I'm like, eh, maybe I won't build my base up here. It doesn't have really a lot of access to resources. Pretty much. Alright, I'm going off pathway because it's just going to be faster and easier at this point. And that'll be the other location I go, and then that green dot in that little lake area over there, that's end game. Yep. Once you know what you're doing, it's the game's relatively really short. It's just getting the damn shovels, the part that takes forever. This looks like a good place to pitch a tent real quick. These are going to be the new saves. And just jump on the tent like that, grab your stick, and go the other way. Next location is going to be over this way. But I explored this area when it was, um, you know, not snowing. 
It's a little golf course all over damn place over here. From this area. Very surprising. It looks more water. Don't mind if I do fill up real quick. So there's a big ass Cannonville village over here somewhere. I prefer to explore it when it's not snowing. Uh, I might just set up a small camp over here. Like nothing big or anything like that. Maybe just like a tree house or something. You see that? I thought it was a wolf or something. Nope, it's a camel. Damn camels, man. Well, we're about to... Let me just see if I am where I think I am. Hopefully I'm not. Hmm. I might be entering that camel village area I mentioned. Not intentionally, but... You kind of get the idea. It's like, uh, <laughs> that might be the abandonment. Horseshoe. Yeah, I am entering the Campbell Village area that I wanted to explore during the day, not during the time. Cabin over here. This is something I wanted to check out. Supposedly it's called the Bannon Cabins over here. I don't know why they call it that. It is definitely not campable. <laughs> is that an abandoned village? I gotta check that shit out. go forwards and follow the pathway. That would be the best way to do it. Let me look at another cannibal village. It's looking pretty abandoned. Oh, it's not breaking me out. My territory. This is my domain. You no touch here. That's exactly what that shit is over there. Probably Campbell Camp of some sort over here. Let's 
I'll pull out my boomstick. No one seems to be home, which is good. Seems to be like abandoned. Don't mind me, I'm currently... Currently it looks like someone's messing with the neighbor's car. Type thing. Don't know if that's true or not. Just make it look like he's washing his gutter, like really. I heard like a pop, like something <laughs> popped a window or something. Are you sure you want to start soon? You see how quickly the boom tick came out? Yeah. Right, we're gonna go check out this village. It's really off uh, the planned route, but hey, look, something's popping into view. I'm guessing this is going to be like a story item at some point. Look. Arrows, okay. Kind of cool. Hmm. Nothing really in there. that oh hi where are you going man you like making noises huh all right let's go over this way let's check that this new location You know what, that should be a thumbnail. Someone be like, wait a minute, where'd you find this? Exactly. We might need to cut a, a couple trees down just to make it look good though. Come on, fruitcake, out of the way. I'm trying to make a thumbnail. Come on, dum dum. Come on. That's why it feels like in viewer chat half the time. Regarding other club owners doing stupid things. Come on. Come on, you can do it. And it's like, Jesus Christ. Sometimes the things you have to do, it's like, come on. Done and wow, it's only been 24 minutes. I'm expecting an hour looking back right now. Damn, might actually get to do the end boss here. I, I still think I'm gonna build a shelter nearby this way I can respond, but uh, you kind of get the idea. I'm not, I don't, not sure what to expect. End game could be. You get to keep Kelvin, 
or you lose Calvin, I don't know. Like I said, there's a lot of unknowns right now. Because I have never beat this since the Forge yet. So, at least in bot in game boss, there's a lot of rumors and shit like that. Sons of Forge reminds me a lot of like Skyrim for some reason. Getting like big Skyrim vibes. for this. to shelter her. See if they actually fixed it. Okay, he doesn't seem to be going after the damn tree. I'm going into this facility for the time being. This is a very lovely hallway of just... Oof. I really hope I'm not going in the back door. feeling I should save. Yeah, we're in the in-game bunker, it would seem. I 
I should probably wait for him to finish gathering that. Yeah. I'm just gonna wait for him to finish. <laughs> that is the end game bunker. And I did not expect it to be coming out of that, like going in the back entrance or. You know, I did not expect that to be the entrance then, basically. <laughs> Well, the reason I'm helping him get the logs now is one, it'll be faster. Two, we'll I have all this crap on the uh, screen here. I don't think you guys want to see that crap. That's a lot of trouble. <laughs> God damn, I can't see shit. So that's going to be our thumbnail. Originally, I was going to do like the little villager as like thumbnail, but. This was this will work as well. Yeah, see over that. Next thing I'm gonna do, seeing if we've made it this far, put my camp right there. Now don't break it. Seems going off for some reason. Wonder what that gooey shit's on the door. Clearly sealing it shut. Eat a bunny. It's a very large facility. Makes you wonder what everything was like before everything went to shit. That would be blood on the thing, and some kind of optimization. Observing tank. Uh, what about this way? Oh, this is Veronica's room. Took me a minute. You know what? This this will be my thumbnail. <laughs> I know he keeps saying, "Pick a thumbnail already." <laughs> oh no, I can't pick up my mind. There we go. People go, "What the hell is that? What did they find now? They're in a the green room, man." That baby is blocked. 
Makes you wonder what this facility was like before it got blown up and destroyed. Used to be pretty sweet, apparently. I wonder how expensive it is to have like one of these rooms in like real life. Oh, why I say that is I would like something like this. I just wonder how expensive it would be. That's all. Probably pretty expensive. Before I go that way, check out this area. Nothing over there. Uh, I didn't have the shotgun already. You got some more stuff there. Crosses burn demons. Okay, not, not, not creepy at all. Some more ammo. It's concerning now. The amount of ammo that they're giving us, that is not a good sign. <laughs> holy shit. It's a nice back room, but holy shit, what happened here? <laughs> Demons out from the underworld. That's what happened. Golden armor, huh? That's how you open that door, supposedly. So now I gotta figure out how to get what I need to go through that door. Right, back to fucking around. That's where I came in. That's Veronica's room. So we know we need to come into this to open that door to get to another area, right?
All right, I want to make him build the structure. And then I'm going to go figure out what I need to do. I'll call this video the journey, I guess. Yeah. Anyways, make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe button. I'm going to go figure out what I have to do to get that door open. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video.